Hello, Gemini, and welcome to your weekly check-in energy reading. Um, so we have it all set out here, so we're just going to jump right in. Um, so we're going to start with this Six of Pumpkins here at the top. I feel like you're giving to a situation. Um, it has a little bit of a heavier energy. I feel like you're putting in the effort. I feel like there are two places you're putting in effort. One being what you feel like you have to do, and the other being something you'd rather do. Um, and I feel like one is like a labor of love and the other, so that may be like a project you're working on um, outside of what you do for a living. Um, yeah, I heard it's my baby. So for some of you, you're working on a very um, project that's close to your heart on the side. Um, but I feel like you are giving to both. It's just you have to give uh, more to one right now. Um, so in the immediate past here, we have the high priestess and, um, we do have occupation on the top. So I feel like, I don't want to say shadow side of energy, but I'm kind of feeling like we're not as happy in the situation as we once were. Like I said, I feel like there's something we'd rather be putting our energy and effort into. Um, but I feel like monetarily maybe it's just not feasible to do that now at this time um I feel like this may be something for the long term so you may be working on something that could potentially be a source of income in the future but I feel like it's just not ready yet so you know we have to go to our everyday maybe nine to five um so if we move on over to I hear midweek um, we may start to see the, this job situation that we have here as feeling a little toxic. Um, I hear a slave to the work. So you may just be a little busier than usual at your job. Um, I feel like the gift in this situation is to see it for what it is. So I feel like whatever this situation is, maybe it's a new job altogether. So maybe you're closing out at one place and and going over to a new place or trying to come into your own business wise. Um, so it's going to differ for all of you, but I feel like the gift in this is just knowing that, um, it's just not fulfilling you. And I think seeing the truth of it is actually a gift in itself. So towards the end of the week, we have this queen of, well, queen of cups, queen of ghosts, and we have the house. So I feel like you're seeing that this job provides financially um, and probably very well. So maybe that's why you've stuck on so long. Um, we do have this seven here, which makes me feel like um, I hear dutiful. So you're staying in this situation and, and trying to make the best of it. Um, I feel like the best of a rotten situation. So you may have, um, you may be working with people who are not I hear as friendly, they may be catty. Um, there may be workplace cattiness that is just, you know, uncomfortable to say the least. Um, we do have a message here. So for those of you who have actually put in for a new job, you may be getting a callback or a message soon concerning um, a, an occupational move. So that may be coming this week or by the end, I feel like of this week. Um, and then we have the world. I think you're just seeing it as, you know, I hear there are bumps in the road on the way to where we actually want to be. I feel like, um, you've already got a head start on that. Um, I hear comfortability. So, so being comfortable, uh, where you are now and what this job seems to provide is in the way of comfort is good. Um, and I hear a, cu a cushion of money. So for some of you, this, this may provide, um, I hear a cushy position. So either that's coming or that's something you already have, but it doesn't come without its toxicities, right? Um, so we have the world here. Uh, I feel like that's the new upcoming energy and that'll probably lead us into like next week. Um, it looks, it looks like, um, things are going to be looking up and perhaps things will be coming full circle in a way. Um, that's what I keep hearing full circle. Um, so maybe something will come back around that you've been waiting for. And that's what this message will be. So that's what I have for you for this week in energy, but we are going to pull some charms. Let me just move these out of the way. 
So we'll put some charms for you for the week, Gemini. Gemini, charms for the week. Anything else? This situation or other? Let's see. I hear you're the star. Um, all right, Gemini, you're the star in this situation. I feel like you are shining. Even if you're in a situation that doesn't seem like it's really fueling you anymore, I feel like, I, again, I hear dutiful. So you're you're still performing the tasks that you need to do to be that shining star um, in whatever it is you do. So we have this Pegasus here. Yeah, this is all about moving forward and, and things coming in swiftly. So I do feel like... Um, this has to do with the reading. I feel like whatever that message is, or it could be, I hear what you're waiting for. So you're waiting on something. I feel like that is coming in or that information is coming in this week, um, perhaps towards the end of the week. Um, so I'm hearing stay busy. So you're going to be pretty busy this week, I guess, just trying to accomplish, you know, everyday life tasks. And then um, the job itself may be a little more intense this week or a little busier than usual. We have the elephant here. I don't, it's something about forgetting tasks. I don't think this is you per se, but this could be people around you. It could, I'm hearing, um, I'm hearing that there may be people around you who do not put 100% in at the job or um, trying to accomplish the same amount that you accomplish. Um, so I don't know if you're, you're the boss and then there are people, I hear incompetence, I hate to say that. Um, but I feel like there are people underneath of you that may maybe work for you or you mm, work side by side with that um, just don't seem to be handling the tasks with the same efficiency that you would or you do, okay? Um, I heard moving to greener shores. So. Like I said, there could be a job move for some of you this week um, or the opportunity to do so. Um, now, I don't know if this actually involves you moving physically. Um, it could for some of you or traveling to work. It could be a little further. It doesn't have to be by boat. It could be, you know, any mode of transportation. Um, I heard don't be shy about it. Um, so... Maybe there's an interview coming up. Um, I feel like don't be afraid to really um, show your biggest and brightest qualities, um, even if you are shy. Um, I hear be bold, be brave. So um, show all that you have to offer. Um, I feel like it's really going to make the difference. Okay, um, that is what I have for you for this week, Gemini. So I'll see you next time.